We unpack. We unpack. We unpack. Coming to your live box and ego unpack. Yeah. We unpack. We unpack. We unpack. Wow, Ryan Garcia was injured, then hospitalized prior to the fight with Javante Tank Davis. So says his sparring partner. Roll the clip. Ryan Garcia tank Ryan Garcia I will video. I will be video. I will be video. I will За энэ Монгол залуу хин бэ ч юм уу ер нь бол шуу гад хилч ин. А тэгээ бас поло моло нэмэгдээд бүр хараж өрөх нь хараж өрөөгөөд ер нь бол лааж ин. За тэгээд би ямар ч гэсэн зүгээр уучлалт хүсэж тийм видео хийсэн. А тэгээ би сарын 6000 долларын цайлантай спарринг партнерөр одоо бэлтгэл хангах би ингэ ажиллаж исэн. Тэгээд 6 дахь спарринг дээр яг тавчихсан цохолтой гизэнд нь цохоод тэгээд гинтчихсэн. Тэгээ Ryan эмлэгрүү би гэрэл уугаа тал цайлантайгаа 3000 долларын цайлантай тэгээд ажил ажил одоо ажлаасаа бараг халагдсан гэсэн үг тэгээ халагдаад би ингээд ирсэн. Тэгээ бэлтгэлээ өөрчлөлөө хийж ихлэ байж исаа тэгээд ер нь бол уучлаарай гэсэн юм л видео ороо дамжуулж хийсэн за за ямар ч гэсэн надад бол боломж байгаа тэгээд миний бодож исэн би миний ингээд хождөг хүмүүс бүгдөөрөө ингээд дэлхийн аварга олимпийн аварга ингээд болцоодсон байж идэг а тэгээд би айгуу сахилга хаттай байгаад бүх бүсийн аав нь идэхтэй итгэлтэй а тэгээд энд нөгөө нэг одоо тав What a fight world is your boy Ego and back with some more boxing. Javante Davis did his thing. He knocked out Ryan Garcia in the 7th round. Vicious vicious and I mean vicious body shot. Ryan Garcia, you know, he showed heart, wasn't able to get back up, but you know, just taking the fight, he really was going from 0 to 60 for real for real in terms of his resume. Now in shocking news, we have this new storyline from an Olympian who happens to be from China. He's Mongolian and he's coming out and he's alleging that he put Ryan in the hospital or Ryan was stopped in sparring or hurt in sparring or injured. And you guys seen the clip. That's what that clip was that I just showed you. Said Ryan was pre-injured leading into the Javante Davis fight. That's what he's claiming. He did a previous video and I made a video about that. You guys, to get caught up in speed, I don't make these videos for my health. I do this for you, the fans. So if you'd like to support, there's many ways you can do that. Throw a like on the video, subscribe, cash app, super chats, hit the join button and make sure you check out some of the other content because I break these things down, but you guys got to get caught up to speed. So make sure you guys check that previous video I did for more on that. So this boxer, and I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce his name because he has a unique name and I'm not good with names, but the Mongolian Olympian boxer says that he entered the Gervonta Davis fight injured. And you see on the screen, these are direct subtitles from that video. It says, Ryan went to the hospital. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you don't miss a thing. Again, it says Ryan went to the hospital and I went home with half of my salary so he was saying that he put hands on ryan to the point where ryan needed to go see a doctor or get checked up and he entered the fight with an injury the first video he was saying sorry that i injured you 
and he got a lot of bad feedback from people saying he was a rat in a mole. That's why he made that second video that you see with this white t-shirt that I played at the beginning of this video. And he's saying, I'm not a rat. I didn't snitch or anything. He said, the only time I brought this up was after the fight. But he's saying he got kicked out of Ryan Garcia's camp. And this is a thing. Hey, King Ryan, in sparring, I injured you with the body shot. Now you lost to Tank. I am sorry. Are you okay? Fortunately for you guys, I felt generous and I included the video the first video he did but i highly advise you guys to go search on my channel find the first video that he did and i break that down in more detail so those are the two videos from this boxer and i'll put his name on the screen so you guys can see and try to pronounce his name but he did fight shakur stevenson in the amateurs and shakur beat him he's claiming that he injured ryan garcia and ryan entered the javante davis fight injured my thoughts absolutely nothing it changes nothing the box wreck is not going to change ryan garcia's wikipedia is not going to change it's the same exact outcome javante davis skill threaded the needle stopped ryan garcia ryan is no longer undefeated and we'll see what ryan garcia's next move is as far as this character coming out with this storyline i mean who knows it maybe it's true maybe it's not at the end of the day, like I said, I'm not going to dwell on it or belabor the point. It changes nothing. If Ryan passed all the commission tests, he didn't notify anyone about this injury, said he was ready to go, said he was 100% healthy. He denied being knocked out in sparring when Tank asked him on the Kai Sinat show when Kai Sinat had them both live. In fact, roll the clip. But look at your face, bro. I know you don't want to do that, bro. You look like Barry Allen from yo, the yo, Flash. Yo, 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 yo. You, you, you I am Barry Allen from the yo, Flash. You didn't get stopped in the gym? No, I didn't. You didn't get stopped in the gym? Nah. Cap. On my life, I didn't. On my life, I didn't. So you didn't get stopped recently in the gym? No, I didn't. No. He's lying. Did you get knocked out by a Russian in Floyd's gym? Didn't they, didn't they say that you got knocked out cold? No. No, you didn't? No. Yeah, you did. No. no they they told me that. Yes, they did. No, no, I didn't. You got knocked out cold it, by a Russian. It only hurt you got knocked it, out cold. It, How old was really, I? How old was I? When I started? You tried 17, left. 18? You tried. Okay, so well, you're going to get me now. You're going to get the version of me now. Okay. Just know that. Okay. No, you, yeah, you exactly. And when you get knocked out by me, I don't want to hear you talk nothing. Yo, I'm, I just want, I just, yo, he's not getting knocked sorry. out, homie. What? He's not getting knocked out. I'm not even <laughs> talking to you. No, f you. <laughs> I'm talking like that. What's up? Put anybody you want against me. Matter of fact, on this fight, I'm banning my whole crib. I'm banning my social security number. I'm banning my birth certificate. I'm banning everything on this. I'm banning my life. I didn't. You're you gonna be homeless. And that was the clip where Javante was asking Ryan Garcia to his face, hey, I heard you got stopped in sparring. Is that true? And he said, all my life, no, it didn't happen. So like I said throughout this video for several reasons, none of that matters. Golden Boy, their fighter took a loss. Ryan Garcia said it didn't happen on his life. Whether it happened or not, like this guy is alleging, it, again, it changes nothing. So Ryan Garcia should just rest up and then worried about like the next move in his career. That's how I see it. I'm not going to cry over spilled milk. Shout out to Ryan Garcia. He really didn't make many excuses. He did say he was a little bit weak and all that, but he's not the one coming up with this. I don't know why the guy just elected to come out now and say it, but Ryan Garcia says it's crazy that he had a rat in his camp. Again, me, I'm not going to cry over spilled milk. What's done is done. Tank knocked him out. He said he was fit to compete, and he got knocked out in the seventh round. For more content like this, the best in the business, subscribe to Boxing Ego, and I'm out. Introducing Super Thanks. Right here on the official Boxing Ego YouTube, Super Thanks allows you, the viewers, to show a little bit of extra gratitude, which enables me as a full-time content creator to push out the content you need in the world of boxing. Underneath all the videos, you will see a heart with the dollar sign in it. You can enter any amount that you find suitable as a super thanks. A brand new interactive and colorful way to get your comments highlighted and noticed by not only myself, but other people on the YouTube platform. Super thanks, a unique and cool way to show and applaud us full-time content creators. Hopefully you guys enjoy the content. Super thanks.
The future is now. The Hibernation 5s by Kenichi Bear. Hybrid gaming and lifestyle headphones. Out of the box, you can connect to any console or PC. Bluetooth ready with a low latency USB adapter, color RGB, and extreme bass mode. The Hibernation 5s adjust to you. Whether you need a gaming, travel, gym or lifestyle headphones, the Hibernations got you covered. The new Hibernation 5s, link in the description. Customize the way you hear the world. Welcome to the nation. Are you tired of your YouTube videos not getting any views? Well, consider TubeBuddy. I've used TubeBuddy for years to scale up my YouTube channel. Now we're sitting over 200,000 subscribers. TubeBuddy is a browser extension that offers a ton of built-in productivity and time-saving services to take your channel to the next level. Use my link in the description to get started with TubeBuddy and level up your channel faster. We working.